Long ago, two brothers bought a golf course. Today we explore the most exciting project on YouTube with a stroke play showdown against PGA Tour winner, Wes Bryan. I think we might have just created the loudest silence in YouTube history though. That is perfect, Pete. We're just making it look easy, huh? We were just mentioning chip-ins and that is not the one that I was expecting. You know, the good thing about golf is the next one can always go in, Pete. Oh, go in. go in the hole. Go in. Whoa! It didn't go in, did it? Welcome to Selena. So we've got 11 holes of pure unadulterated stroke play. We're doing 11 holes because the back nine, which has all been laid, and we'll talk about kind of Selena and what's going on here throughout the video. There's a 80 foot bridge that needs to be lowered into place to get over what I think is a lake, what these guys call a pond. Neither here nor there. It's neither here nor there. Right, driver round the corner. Now this is a ballsy shot, first thing in the morning. I've, I've been visualizing this tee shot all night. Love that. I just started visualizing it right now. I'm two steps behind already, I reckon. Not there. It's fine. That, that is more than likely going to be in the fairway. Ah, like the, the green is here. I know exactly where it is, but it's, it's very, right, right over that tallest tree that you can see. It's just very imposing to hit it first thing in the morning. It is. Hit the middle though. It's a good start. Maybe, maybe if we go to extras, we'll be loose and we'll come back to this hole. Yeah, we're not going to be going to extras. We're not going to go to extras. No, we're not going to okay. go to extras. I don't know why I grabbed the smallest possible club face to hit off the first tee, I but I got hybrid. <laughs> This is another reason why I chose to hit driver. <laughs> Very nice. Very what good. A shot to start the day. So I think I think I reckon our two shots are probably going to end up quite similar, there, aren't they? I think so. I hit the middle of the club face and good. wedge in our hand, and off we go. Guys, this is going to be an epic encounter. We've got sixty-three of them, and. Uh, Got the lob wedge in hand. Be so nice to get off to a good start. If the uh, 1v1v1 hasn't been released yet, just know that it didn't go well. All right, 62 yards. Glare on this club face. This is a bad sun for this, but we'll push through. Wow, what a kick. Yeah, directionally poor. I think the distance is gonna be fine. You know, come down the slope a little bit as well? Uh, Hopefully there was some spin and it didn't get to that slope. Okay, so just come through the fairway. You'll see kind of around this course, still a fair bit of work going on. Obviously this has been a completely relayed, relayed, redone course within the last kind of 12 months or so. I don't know how far I've got actually. What do you reckon, 50? Yeah. Ooh, it's not the easiest opening birdie for a hole that looks like it's 320 yards on the scorecard that's wide open. So um, this is a fun green. I'm pretty excited about this complex when the greens get real fast. Right now they're firm because they're brand new, but they haven't quite got the speed yet that we're looking for. If you do that, if you hit a bad shot, you make sure you hit the next one with the same club. Uh, I've only made one vow in my life, and that's to never chip with a nine iron ever again. <laughs> so apart from that, I'll use just about anything. Usually lob wedge, actually always lob wedge to chip with. Actually always lob wedge if I'm off the green, period. Don't care if it's a foot off the green. It's just, it's just more fun. I like chipping in instead of putting in. If you tell people you putted it in from off the green, it's not cool to be like, oh, I had a chip in today. You're yeah. like, oh, that's it. No, it's 12 feet, a foot off the green, but it just sounds better. That is so well played, Pete. Oh my. Did we just... Oh! We were just mentioning oh. chip-ins and that is not the one that I thought... <laughs> How did that not turn That's in? That's not the one that I was expecting. That's a great shot, Pete. How did that not turn in at the end? Now trying to find a ball mark. Finding ball marks on brand new greens, borderline impossible. There's times where it was a little softer, but right now we wanted to make sure you felt like you were back home, so we made sure they were they left the water off of them, firmed them up. Big respect. We were just, we Thank were preparing you. for your presence, Pete. Uh, if you want to make me feel like I'm back home at the moment, like make them as soggy as possible. <laughs> really? Yeah. I, I want to see my ball plug when it hits the green at the moment. Plug. 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 
Get wow. started hot early, baby. Come on, let's go. Oh, uh, you know, it did warn me. It did warn me. Uh, Wes sent me a message about, I don't know, 2.30 this morning and said, basically, it's on. Like, it's on. I've, I've got it. I'm back. Are we doing stroke play or match play? Uh, stroke. This is official RNA rule, sir. Should we start bringing up old Tom Morris again, or did we beat that one to a pulp yesterday? <laughs> yeah, I think, I think old Tom can rest easy today. <laughs> I don't think we need to uh, sacrifice him on the altar of YouTube anymore. Well, that was an interesting stroke. Went in there. Uh, yeah, mine felt a little wobbly too. <laughs> but again, <laughs> the great ones figure it out. Mate, you're damn right. We'll figure it well, well, that's uh, one under straight oh, away. Uh, yeah, please. Oh, oh. Good on, good on, well done. 181. 181. 181 of them. I've still not figured this whole out in two days. Um, uh, the green's firm and it slopes from left to right and from front to back. So we're going to go with a soft cut seven. Seven, yes, yeah, seven is the number. I've hit eight short i think seven short there wasn't a lot of commitment behind it i will concede that every par three we've played so far is like such a hole in one hole like you're looking down on everything well that was literally that, that that's the part the i got excited and so even on the back nine we've got like a short one with a wedge that we've got a couple funnel pins like it's going to be a fun one Stop it. the other one is just same thing amazing green absolutely beautiful we got five par threes out here and they all are amazing and now back at the task at hand soft cut Sailed. That's really poor contact, Pete. But I think it might work it out. Might work out, yeah. Just keep, just keep meandering. Yeah, you didn't try that well at all, did you? I mean, I'll take it, it in a nice way. You know, the good thing about golf is the next one can always go in, Pete. I mean, I hope this one does. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I hope this is the next one. How many hole in ones have you had? One. One? Just one. Was it on camera? It was, but I couldn't see the bottom of the pen. Good thing that one didn't plug. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, uh, gosh, I'm sorry. I'll be here all day, guys. Anyway, right. Sit back, relax, and enjoy. I'm going to hit seven iron out where's his ball and just, just let it peel a touch. Keep fading. I mean, those could not have been more identical. Ah, very sociable. Yeah, let's go up there and have a good time, Pete. Okay, cool. Let's have a chat. I'll tell you what, I have never eaten my words so quick because I thought this ball was on the green. Get up here, it's off the green, and I only brought one club with me. So we're not going back to the cart. Just going to have to make do. I actually need to concentrate on my main point because I was stood up there and I wasn't really paying attention. A little bit right to left at the end. That's a quick. Oh. Wow. Took a really. That's fine. Really man. right hop there. It's all right, though. That's, that's a good putt. Do you like it left or out? Uh, you can pull it. That's good. These pins have not been the friendliest pins I've oh, ever played touch on. Touch this flag. Look at this. Look at that flag game. How good's that? Being Augusta. Turn Go in. in. Great pace put. P pace, pace was there. Direction. Wow. PJ Pro suddenly come out. Just knock you by the green. Walk off with your three. Wait for the par fives. There's only one of them. There's only one of them on the front nine. Actually, only one of them open. But the two on the back nine, great, great five pars. All right, we got a par four, about 400. We're, they're working on the back tee box right now, so we stayed off the back box. About 430, 440 yards from here, so. A little bit straighter with this tee shot, isn't it? No. You want, well, you want to hit it a little more right. You still want to kind of hug the tree line. Okay. First full whack of the day, we'll see what happens here. Everybody, hold your breath. Pretty good. Oh yeah, I I mean I adore it. Oh okay, good. 
it might just be in the right rough, but it's on grass. It was hit on club face and I can hit it again. And that's the name of my game. Between the trees, if I can hit it again, I'm thrilled. Hey, what more could you want? Just nothing. try the perfect round of golfer. Literally nothing. Hit it, find it, hit it again. That is perfect, Pete. Thank you. Yeah, starting to drive it well again. That's real good. Thank you. I try. <laughs> we found the short stuff. That's two decent tee shots, huh? Yeah, 126 yards. You know, we aren't playing by the uh, old RNA rules. Because we got new fairways, you can still get some, some odd lies here and there. So we are playing the ball up here. It's a local rule we've put in place that Pete can't argue with. I've you, you do not hear me arguing. That's absolutely <laughs> fine with me. Uh, 126. I got a uh, 52 degree in hand. Really a good pin. Anything just right of it should kick down towards the hole. Yeah, there's a little slope there, isn't there? So I can hit kind of my weak fan over to the right and it still work out pretty good. Or we can hit a chunk pull and uh, miss another green with a wedge. That is is terrible. I, that wasn't the best shot I've ever seen you hit. Tell you what, this is this is how this is how you know you're, you're not dialed. When you start, I, I look at the strike and I go one, two, three, four, five, six, six. Between the sixth and seventh groove is the strike. Mm. I'm wanting that thing to be down on the third groove. Yeah, if you venture into seven territory, you've got some issues there. Yeah, unfortunately, I got more issues than just that. Okay, 108 yards, which on the face of it. Just a nice, smooth, simple, just over half a 54 degree. There is like a little, um, a little bit of help just to the right of this pin that can bring the ball back down to the hole. So, oh, that is delightful, Pete. Yeah, that's about kind of what we pretty good. thought would happen. Well Stop. played. Hey, that, that's a great shot. I'll... No, 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 no. no. I, I'm, I'm your guest. I will. Salt Bay, huh? Sand Bay. You're welcome. All right. Supreme disadvantage here, but I think a great theologian once said, the wedge is the great equalizer. This has been struggling a little bit, but I don't see any evidence of that. Great I'm shot. I'm seeing a theme develop with every chip shot I hit. They're just going right. Yeah, I don't know how you cope. You seem to be getting through. Do you want your puzzle? Or... Mm. We can just uh, clean it up with that one. Here you go. You, you look at your putt because it takes you a while to do all your little okay, your antics. Okay, okay. And I was going to find your pitch mark for you. So it works. Like, can't be the knife. <laughs> I'm just saying we all saw it coming from 100 plus yards away. <laughs> we all saw it coming. Just saying you might not like it, but aim point's the future. Don't trust your eyes, kids. Trust I'll tell you feet. what. Aim point is the future of wrecking this game that we all love. Good. Pace of play. Good. False I'm sense of security. It. I'm here for there, it. The list can go on. You know, that, you know what? I'm, I'm starting to become an advocate. Everyone's saying, got to grow the game. Shrink it. Make it smaller. You know what I mean? Really kind of contract it. <laughs> oh, that's nice, Pete. Wow, it stayed in the air a long time. It sure did. Oh, whoa, wow. Hard. You are hitting it far, Pete. Jeez. Oh, that surprised me. How far is this hole from the backs? Honestly, don't know. I'll just say 4... 30. Two. 4.30? 
I've had this sticker on me this whole time, haven't I? <laughs> I <laughs> literally right. But you don't you, you, you protect it. I keep it on there. I think it's a good look for it. Good look, Joe. Just not, I, I, I'm not I'm putting it on the ground. I'm not littering. I'm gonna pick it up. I just want the record to show I don't litter. I take care of the planet. I recycle. I drive an electric vehicle. And I don't use plastic plates or forks. And I hit absolute bombs. Hit the ball, you idiot. Oh, just the man speaks the truth. I'll just sit, <laughs> sit. Kick left, kick left. Oh, kick right. Yeah, just get up in that rough. Ah, that's all right there. Good angle in from there. Yeah. Oh, wait. Speaking of some more breaking news, got another wedge in our hand. 138 yards, electing a pitching wedge. Have you given it a zap, mate? You can, you can give it a zap. 138. We're gonna try and uh, hit ball first here. Oh, be good. We sure did get ball first. Oh, go just in. go in the hole. Go in. Oh, it didn't. Beauty. It didn't go in, did it? That is a ball that I'm seeing. Did you misread that? Uh, no, I just hit it gently thin, so it was ah. able to... Oh, the thin <laughs> gentle I got you. Wait a second. Is that past? I think it might just be past. That ball is past all. I thought it was short. No, that's why I was asking if you misread it. Oh my, yeah, yeah. I misread it. Totally no, I misread through it. through the break. 120. Pins on like a little plateau at the back there. And we know everybody at home is doing the math. Yes, Pete did hit it 18 yards further than me. Again. 120, I'm just gonna hit 54 degree, just try and hoist it up a touch. That is so fat. <sighs> hey, I tried that on the last hole and it didn't make it to the green. How did that one? Yeah, oh yeah, it didn't make up? it. <laughs> Why did I just like <laughs> hit the ball first? It's, just, it's such a simple task. It was so, set up so poorly to that. This is one part of the game today that I'm kind of hoping to do really well with my chipping. Cause lonely. I want to impress. I'm so lonely. I want to impress Wes, but so I'm just going to play this left of the hole, a little bit of release to roll back to the right. Oh, it stops so Just fast. a little short. God oh, damn. Not my best. All right, come on, good put needed here. Man. Pete! Pete! Keeping those blemishes off the card. I, it's very, yeah, it is doubtful you will come across a better par putt than me. I'll make it hard for myself. <laughs> sure, sure did. <laughs> Go on, for a bird. Oh my oh, goodness wow, gracious, that, that hit a, a right. train wreck right here. I went, Phew. the new green wiggle, it's a real thing. Got me there. Well, you know it's what they say part. about these subtle greens at Salina. These greens don't bump, by the way, edit that out. They're perfect, they're smooth, <laughs> they're perfect. It's very different though. Yeah, so we came up, front tee box is probably 30 yards in front of it. Again, there's no reason for us not to go back. I just wanted Pete to be able to see from a little higher up the actual hole, so. This yeah. is how it was intended for member play, and so that's where we're playing it from. That's great. I mean, every hole so far has been, just looks good. Looks clean as well. Looks rough around the edges, but clean. I know what you're saying. Yeah, yeah. It's kind of hard to describe what I'm feeling right now. I'm six, I'm six coffee short of being, uh, being able to access my full vocabulary. You'll really like that one, Pete. That one looks pretty <laughs> A bit of a round of applause is a... Uh, I mean, and look at that wow. thing Good. bound. That was scampering, wasn't it? Wow, love that. Mm. It's drifting. It'd be all right though, wouldn't it? Oh, that's gonna be just fine. Really, that's kind of the, the preferred method. Just get it on that dirt path and just let it roll. Ah, the dirt path shooter. Yep. Got you, all right. Get a nice, good, clean look to the green. Dirty look. <laughs> <laughs> kind of like looking at my butthole. I mean, 
I watched I watched it kick on the the it should have just rolled. Well, well uh, the excavator will be out later on. <laughs> this will be all banked. <laughs> be like a NASCAR track by this afternoon. So now we gotta figure out how to because I don't think we can get we just gotta get it on the, the stuff right in front of us. Just like that. Excellent touch. 108. Listen, all you need is you you're one good wedge shot away from walking off with a really solid par. Admittedly, this is the kind of one case in golf where the scorecard does have a picture, so everyone will know how you made par, but yeah, well, I think everyone will appreciate it. 108, I got sand wedge in hand. Definitely need ball first here. Oh, slip. Oh, wow. God, I that, slipped. Oh, oh no. just be good. Oh. Spin? No, it oh, got Just hit the slope, didn't the, it? The no, it was the slip and then like the freak out flinch. I just hit it a little too hard. Just There was a lot going on with that shot. I think, it's, I think considering you hit it on one foot, that's pretty, it's a pretty good result. 95. 95. It's on that. It's a really weird pin, this, like just after it. It's got like a slope that will carry it down. Is it better like just landing it and skipping it? You, 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 you want to just have it end up ideally, well, ideally in the hole, but if you're going to err on one side, I'd leave it a few feet short of the hole. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Oh my God, that's gone so far. You've, you've done a bad thing. You've made a mistake. I actually know what this uh, is doing. I don't need to aim point this. I'm going up the hill, right to left, and then just at the end, it's just going to wobble back to the right. I know this, but I've got this one. Come on. Oh, I love a yellow flag as well. Oh, just... Oh. Didn't get it far enough that way. It's good pace. You know what? I'm going to keep that flag in too because I love a yellow flag as well. Such a good contrast, isn't it? So. Yeah. Yellow and green. Don't know where else has done that. Uh, as far as I know, nowhere. Turner. Where's the, where's the, whoa, whoa. Whoa. Oh, no. That is a dead sheep there, mate. Uh, I think I might actually have further from the hole. We are really making a mess of things here at the fifth. <laughs> Got uh, an extended putt for bogey. This was part of the uh, production meeting we had beforehand. It's all about retention, just, you know, stretching these holes out. Yeah, struck. Mm, needed it. Nice putt. I got one of, uh, got Willie Z's Ooh. broom handle coming through. Well, the Odyssey survives. Another day. <laughs> Goodness gracious. And just like that, Pete takes the lead. Right, this is the par five. Uh, driver straight up the chute. Um, and then, yeah, it's like a six, seven, nine in. And this green is a, it's a very tough second shot. Joyous time. So kind of like out that bunker, a little fade. Oh, buddy. You gonna, you gonna like that one, Pete. <laughs> you, you gonna like that one a lot. That's scampering. It's good to have a, good to have a hype, man. <laughs> On the course. No need to talk about what I want to do here. I just want to do exactly as Pete did. Beauty. Nice. Very good. <laughs> oh, yeah, that was good. Can, can, can we have a tracer on, uh, on Wes as well? <laughs> Wes Tracer. He's on. <laughs> we, get to have a we got 215, down about 15 yards, which makes it 200. We're going to land it at 186. Feels like a solid six iron just left of the hole. How about uh, just right of the hole and go down the hill and way short. That's not good. Stay short. Yeah, we're just gonna, I'll just ride up and watch you hit Pete. All right, 202, let's think about it. So it's 202, it is down. Is it, do you think it's a touch into? Yeah. I mean, the flag is flat calm. I just don't know whether to do like that Rory kind of style eight iron. Or just like a feathered seven to the front half, front left of that green. 
Anytime you get the opportunity to be Rory, I think you should take it. Let's go full on. I mean, just short left of this green is fine anyway. Oh, it's so. great. Yeah. Oh, that ain't Rory. The apex was like Rory. <laughs> I think it might have been a Rory 7. Yeah, <laughs> I think I think that might have just been a normal 7. <laughs> I think that might have been a case of Pete just like, you know, know your limitations. Get back in your box. God, so far, that was such a bad, bad shot, bad strike. Oh, what, what's the saying? Play the shots you know you can hit, not the ones you want to. All right, so quite a straightforward one, really. 60 degree, five feet onto the green. So it trundled down. Whoa! Wow. Sit down. That first top was huge. <sighs> That's just a really, really firm first bounce there. Now this is the shot. This is a shot I want to be seeing. If I'm going to go low, I got to just play it way over there. I just don't want to deal with this slope. So I'm going to set the club face open. I'm going to fan it even more open. And then I'm going to throw the hands at it. And hopefully get this thing spinning right, stopping quick, and having a chance to go in the hole. Oh. It's just too firm and just, it slopes just, away. I just... So good. I just can't... Couldn't quite get. I mean, the way you talked that through just was get exceptional. Stop quick enough to go right and go in the hole. You know, if if I came over for nothing else and figured that shot out, it's worth it. It's a fun one. It's great. All right, a bit a bit further away for better than I wanted. A lot further away. Not going to turn in that. Wow, one. no break. Yeah, I'd... that was a good putt. Should have trusted my feet more. <laughs> Bruv. See, my feet were saying that it was only like a inside right, but my eyes were saying more. Never trust my eyes. I'll tell you what, I've got my eyes, my feet, my emotions all in alignment here. Right center. Babe. Lovely up yeah. and down, mate. Now, tell you what, dodged a bullet there from Pete making par on a par five with an eight iron in his hands, but <laughs> got one back. We got a tight, we got a tight ball game. But admittedly that eight iron was the wrong club. It was but completely it, the wrong it club. It was completely the wrong club. And you you taught me into it subtly. I, I appreciate that, respect that. You know what? I'm just having a great day. Vibes are immaculate. Got 220 yards downhill, wind off the left. I'm just gonna try and hit the same shot I hit on the last hole. Feels right. Very good. Very good. Yeah, it's all right. It's all right. It's a good put from there as well, isn't it? Kind it of is. Slow. It didn't go bounding past the flag like most balls on this hole, which is good. I was going to go one more. It's going to go seven, just aiming for that front left of the green. I'll get the hole now. Oh, go. oh, Pete, did you get enough of it? Go, 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 go. That is stalling. Oh, wow. I'll tell you what, Rory, Rory's in a power slump right now. That just. That same shot flew like. On the front third of the green yesterday. Yeah. Like halfway, it just seemed to be like, I struck it all right. How's your caffeine consumption been today? Low. See, that's part of it. Damn. Rory starts his day with like eight cups of coffee. I don't actually know that at all to be true. And my guess is an athlete like him, there's no way it's true. Nah, no, it could be. You never know. He's probably more of a tea guy. No, I'd say he's more of a coffee guy. I bet he's more of a tea guy. In the comment section, what do you think? Is, is Rory a coffee or a tea guy? Coffee. I'm going to go team coffee. Team tea. Right, I need to land this. Just on the front section and then let it feed down. Pete's just got to get this one on the green. He's actually landing it on pretty much like a little turtle shell. If it's too far left, it's going to kick left. Too far right, it's going to kick right. He actually just decided not to land it on the green at all. So, uh... <laughs> ah, well. Birdie, uh. mate. Yep, here That's we go. This right here, this right. would change things. 
This is the moment that would change things, Pete. Could have been a potential two-shot swing, but that's not happening. That was a bad putt, huh? Bit of a push. Uh, yeah, wild push. <laughs> Lifeless. That's gone that way. Whew. This, this is what a lead feels like again. Missed that feeling. went that way. Oh, back to level par versus one over. One under. So this place is called Hump Pond, and my, my definition of a pond is if you can swim it. Anything beyond that is a lake. Now from that end to that end, that is a lake. At the very least, it's a mere. Whatever it is though, that is not a pond. Is there a fish bigger than a goldfish in there? It's a lake. <laughs> All right. Uh, that's good. Right edge? It's great, Pete. It's great. I love it. I can hit it again. As Borat would say, great success. You'll love it, Pete. You'll love it. Thank you. Just need to hit the green. Yeah. That's the issue right now. You know what? You might see a guy in the, the background lurking in the shadows. This is uh, George Bryan III, AKA Diddy, AKA my pops, AKA the director of golf out here at Selena. Everybody welcome G3 to the channel. I'm glad you're here. Full yards. Do you want me to go first? Uh, sure. I'm a bit past you, but that's fine. Don't mind. 84 yards, right. Lob wedge. Load it with spin. Come on. Just a three quarter. That's a great shot, Pete. Spin hard. It's okay, it's not in a bad spot there. It's kind of like putting back up the hill, but bit of a pull, bit of a pull. Wedge game needs work. We also have 84 yards going with lob iron. I'll try and draw the string on this one a little bit. Get it to actually back up from a pitch mark. Try and get it as close to that hole, if not in that hole. Oh, I hammered it. Sit, goodness sit, gracious, sit, 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 sit. float, sit. I'll spin. Wow. I hammered it, Pete. How'd you get that much spin on that? Just it's the same, it's the same thing. It's just a harder mode where, where you just throw the hands at it, let it pass a little bit, a little bit of speed. And for me, I'm over the top, so I, I it produces a natural little cut, which also adds spin. Wow. That's a lot of spin on these greens, that. Is wow. it just me, Pete? Uh just you, mate, yeah. All right, it is just me. Oh, got this one uphill, to right to left, and uh, got to keep the pedal down. Uh, wow. Uphill, it's like I said, it's left to right. Yeah. What I say out here at times, you can build them, but you can't always read them. Probably should have used my feet there. See, that's the thing, like, well, I'm reading these great. <laughs> no, no problem reading these greens. All right, it's just a nice par, tough hole. Same that. I'm going to get the thing. Right, it's got a turn. I just don't know if it's going to flatten out to which end. Come on, aim point. Ah! <laughs> that is the middle finger of aim point right there. Wow. That is middle finger only. Oh, the golf gods do not like aim point. No. A reach down and bogey flick that out the hole. A bogey flick? Hmm. Like a. Oh, a booger flick. Yeah. A booger. Booger. Oh, he said a bogey flick. Oh, the bloody booger. All right. Scores remain the same. Wow, that. That was quite. That was that one. <laughs> you... <laughs> that really hurt. That is a, that is a dagger straight to my heart. Wow. Great.
All right, into the wind, 175 down to 170. Gonna hit a very similar shot to hole number two. Is that feathered seven? Just a nice feathery seven. Sounds absolutely perfect. This has just got some hole in one vibes, this one. Oh, go ahead and speak it into existence, Pete. Yeah, that's a bad shot. Yeah, that hole is not over there. Is that near that little bowl you were talking about? No, that's off the green entirely. Oh. Oh, it's awkward. And George is down there. He's he's taunting me, I think. <laughs> that is, he's got the hands on the hip and a really straight face. I can see it from 175 such yards. Such a golf judgmental pose, that, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Like, <laughs> I would have done better. Oh, clear the house. Get over the hazard. Fat, lazy, stupid YouTube. 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 So far short. Got this massive bang to go. Big old fat strike. A little bit left to right, and the, the lie is. I mean, I can get a stance. I'm not standing in the in the hazard. It's only just crept over, but it's more, it's like super, super like fluffy. It's like loads of room underneath the ball. It's gonna have to be like a pop just to the left of the pin and hopefully it releases a touch. Sit. Oh, good shot, Pete. Well played. Must have been, I thought that was. That was real nice. Yeah. I thought I did that really hard. He gripped, yeah. Now I would say from here, this is a little ill-advised, but I feel like I can land it anywhere from the top of the slope, kind of on the down slope, and it should kick down towards the hole. <laughs> That's it. So That's how can you not think that shot's practical? I mean, it's just a, it's an entirely too large of a swing to get it to go there. Yeah, fair enough. Looks and when it goes wrong, it goes it, it can go real wrong. I'll just go ahead and clean it up. Yeah, all right. Right. Thank well, you. this kind of feels pretty important. Yeah, with two to play, every putt's big from here to the house, Pete. It's just a whisper off the right. Just a fantastic wow. par. Let me get your clubs. I'll get the your head covers. No, let me get it all for you. <laughs> After that, up now. Are you kidding? From down in the hazard, <laughs> just making it look easy. Huh? I mean, that that was great. It was great up and down. If we're going to be picky, you know, I don't really think I should have been down there. Let's call it. I want to explore everything that Selena has to offer. It it has a lot of sugar plums and fairy dust and. Unicorn horns. I, I must admit, down the sick fairway, I did think I saw a unicorn lurking in the trees. All right, we are gonna try and ship it over the cross creek there. It's probably a 275, 280 carry or so. Just get over. Whoo, okay. Oh, what? We're over it. Oh, um, <laughs> we're over it. We're in a good spot now. <laughs> it was a little bottom on the on the face. That's why it kind of cycled up. Pete, you got plenty to get over it. No, but that, that literally just crept over. I didn't hit it great, and you've been hitting it 18 yards back by me all day. That's delightful, Pete. Yep. You'll like that. You know what? That's one of the best shots of it today. Sensible play, Pete. Sensible play. 149 yards into breeze. So, normally it's a wedge. I'm going to hit a feathery cut nine just beyond the pin, which is going to give me a put left to right for a birdie. Oh, please be good. Oh, big time shot, Pete. Please be good. 
Oh no. Get up, get up, stay oh, up, no. stay up, stay up. Ooh. Oh. That's you, a good quality shot. Oh. You may be able to tell about the racks. There's a little ridge in the green there. <laughs> there is. And, and I it, just stayed on top. Wow. As you can tell, it didn't carry by much. Just a, fr a few paces. Got 102 yards. Little upslope, little into the wind. If, if you were like playing a tour event, would you still make that choice? Like drive, would you think? Um, I don't know. Not it sure. would be a game time decision. It'd be a game time decision. Probably not. Mm. I don't know if all the risk is worth the reward in, in tournament golf, yeah, but yeah. In, in YouTube golf, feels worth it. This is, this is a tour event for me. It is. I'll treat it like it right now. <laughs> Just watch me go to work, Pete. Go, 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 That's go, go. That's just go. horrifying. Stay. Oi. Stop. I should have grabbed one more iron. Just shot straight up there, then off that slope. Yeah. That was just was poor decision making on my part. Not gonna lie. I'm okay with it, you know. Not gonna lie. It's just another really bad shot. Nothing we can't overcome, though. <laughs> Oh, go, go. just, oh. just hit it. I mean, that's so bad. We just had a hundred yards in, and now I am absolutely struggling. I don't want to. Uh, I don't want to curse things, but Ugh. feeling feeling pretty positive about this point. A two-shot swing would be pretty heart-wrenching at this point. I fancy this way more than I should. decision making all around from the fairway or from the rough. It's horrible decision making. Oh, <laughs> wow. Talk about too close for comfort there, Pete. Uh, how, 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 how? Talk how? about too close for comfort. Wow. That is two foots in a row that. Well, no. This is one putt for a little bit of a blanket, a little security blanket. Gotta be an old boy. <gasps> Two putts for a little bit of a dog fight at the last. Oh, that. <laughs> I want the record to show that that is a bad, bad five. That's a bad one, Pete. Oh, my, my apologies, my apologies. Well, that's a bad one. We head to the last, just all knotted up at the top. I just, I just feel like a- What are we doing? Just a slight little momentum shift there as well. Like, what are we doing? Got a little positive wind at my back. Okay. Set the cart back there so that I could give myself time to regroup and think about yeah. all the bad things that I just did there. Yeah, I don't mind that. Good tactic. My skip. Could have pulled forward. the cart right up here. No. Your tee play away, sir. Great. I mean, this is going to be the 18th, isn't it? So mm -hmm. great last hole as well. Tight. Maybe we got some left. Sod pallets up there for you to aim at. You got four four good aiming points. Ooh. I, think... I know you liked the tree yesterday, but. So I can eat, I can be even more precise today. Yeah, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go with the leftmost sod pallet. Okay. Yep. Sod pallet, and just try and get a little draw. Little draw. Come on. That's gonna be fine. Yeah. A little bit more than I wanted, but that that left rough is no stranger to mud balls either. Well, it's fine. I've uh, I've been looking at the local rules pretty closely, so one big drive here can change your life. <laughs> Rude mine. Oh gosh, one bad drive can ruin your life. <laughs> Just get over all of it. That'd be miles. Oh away, yeah. It missed, missed the trees. We're good. Ow. Fucking <laughs> stickers. Dang. No, I picked up one with stickers to move all the junk around it. Don't you, don't you move ball. 
Not not at this stage in the game. Yeah. You go about Zemo. Ah. You and, you and that's Hiker. Oh, oh goodness. Oh. <laughs> oh, buddy. This is this is not how you want things to end. Not on a technicality. A couple stickers go right in my hand. Oh, wow, that was intense. I had... Now I'm trying to figure out where the pin is and how far we have and how we're going to get it close. Not sure what I was expecting this last hole, but using a spiky stick as a chopstick to move other sticks was was not in the play. But how far we got? We got 183. Every we played this three times now. I'm sure we're getting further back every time. Yeah. Well. Now I got a good line on the pin. And that is no banana. That's actually, wow, that could Whoa. be in a bad spot. That's it. Left. Left of the hole is way better than right of the hole. Oof. But boy, oh boy, this is not what the doctor ordered here. No, nope, sure isn't. You got a great angle and you got 178 yards. 178, straight down draft. 178, straight down draft. Wanna be landing this at 178 iron. Just try and control it. Oh, Do not go spot. right. Do not go right. Hold that line. That's Hold that line. That's a bad spot to be, Pete. That's a real bad spot. Oh no. Oh. So it's a battle of the short games. I wonder who's going to win that. Oh right. no, and I'm not in the fairway. Oh, in the rough down here. All back uphill though. Just major key. This hopefully will be a shot I remember for the rest of my life. It's time for just a little bit of magic to strike here at Selena. Hole number 18. Just so good. Great not shot, the worst right? effort, not the best effort. But we got, I think we got a good chance here. Wow. Three feet with Peter yet to hit. And he's got to sit and look at it knowing that that's probably going to go in. Thinking he's got to get up and down to, I like, I like where we're at. A little bit right to left. I'll even leave my ball there for a little backstopping opportunity for him. What you can't see is just how much this ball is running away from the flag. Oh, what a golf shot, Pete. It's like a little putt off, huh? It's a little putt off for the championship. It's one of those weird things where like, I'm feeling very confident at our bunkers. Right now. <laughs> Ludicrously confident at our bunkers. What a great shot by Pete. Wow. What how's, a great shot. How's the nerves? What a great shot. <laughs> hmm. Mm. Man, this yeah. is this is happening right now, Pete. I think, sit and watch. I, mean, I, I think we might have just created the loudest silence in YouTube history there, I think. But. It, just, it just hurts the soul. Okay. No. Sorry. 
not a competitor you are. Or general you are. Just a pleasure to share this interpreter. See you next time.